Are the prices you see on Kono24 or any other resale platform, are they market prices or what is going on there? So the most common question I get is, Mo, how do you get the watches? And that answer is going to go answer your question. It's basically we are part of a, a private network. We're in like these, these WhatsApp group chats that, you know, you have to basically be invited into them and you're getting access to these watches. The thing is, because all these groups are private, you don't know what the, the market's selling at. And there's no way of updating because it changes every day. So every dealer's inventory changes daily. So what you have today, you don't have tomorrow. Or like that trend that went viral is like, yesterday's price is not today's price. And that came because of that whole thing. That being said, for someone example says, Mo, uh, I want a Smurf, like a discontinued uh -oh. Submariner, blue dial, blue bezel, white gold. Well, in order to understand where it is, you're going to see, okay, it's between 160 or 180 to 200,000 dirhams. Is that the price that I'm getting it? No, it's nowhere near it, to be honest. Because you have to understand that I think it's 8% or 8 to 10% of heard 6%. I don't know, they keep on changing the percentages, but Chrono, uh, Chrono 24 has that premium you have to add. Plus, they know that you have to negotiate. So a lot of the times the dealers put it up. Also, a lot of dealers don't take down the listing because it generates them traffic to their website. Because if you go and you click on a dealer's profile, you'll see the dealer and that's free advertising. So all these dealers have their profiles. And, you know, like sometimes you'll see a watch and like, let me call this uh, dealer and see if he has it. They don't have these watches. It's all, I don't want to say it's fake listings. I'm not here to say that. I'm just saying a lot of times if they had it, they sold it and it's no longer available, but they will keep the listing up because it doesn't make sense to remove free traffic to your brand, to your website. And to be honest, if I was on Chrono24, I would do the exact same thing. Why would you not take free traffic? And then, you, you know, you're going to say, I don't have this, but I could get you into this or get you into that. So it's very difficult in terms of pricing, but but Chrono gives you the closest thing to reality. Minus 10 to 15%. <laughs> I can imagine it's a nightmare also. So how do I even get a watch from you? It's, can you walk me through the process? So how we get a watch? So basically... I just write you, hey, I need my... Uh, Batman ASAP. So basically a lot of people, you'll find, probably find me on social media and all the content we create or on our website. I make it very easy that I push everything through WhatsApp. And um, yeah, so you basically tell me, hey, hey, mom, I'm looking for a Batman. For example, like you just said, I'll say, okay, no problem. Um, and then I just take information when you're looking to buy. So again, prices change um, every day. I shouldn't say for this one, not as much every day, but you know, it changes time to time. So. Recently, I don't know if you've heard that like the Pepsi has it, they're going to discontinue it. So like the Pepsi overnight just skyrocketed and the Pepsi is actually connected. Now people that don't buy, that can't get the Pepsi, they want to get the Batgirl. So now the price of the Batgirl Jubilee went up uh, or Batman Jubilee or Batgirl. You guys choose your lingo. And the Sprite uh, Jubilee also went up. So uh, these things happen all the time. So I get a time day. It's like, okay, mom, I'm ready to buy. No problem. So I basically go into my network and um, I'm saying, okay, guys, I'm looking. I have a client. He's looking for a, a, a Batgirl or a Batman. You know, um, what's the price? And I'll check all the dealers who has the best price. So then I'll find the person that has the best price for you. And then I'll come back to you and be like, oh, this is how much it is. And we had a small fee for obviously our service. And that's it. And basically um, you leave a small deposit for the watch then personally fund the rest of the watch for you. So because a lot of times we don't, Rolex doesn't give us watches, we have to buy it from the dealer. So, you know, to get a commitment, you pay a deposit, I pay the balance, and then the balance is on delivery. And um, the cool thing that um, I love to do when I come to deliver a watch is really take my time, sometimes maybe even over an hour with the client, explain everything about the watch, from setting it up to what the card means, the box, there's a lot of different information out there and just explaining them the whole process. It's a few years ago, buying my first watch was a big thing. And I know for a lot of clients is that, and you have to take that into consideration. It's not, it's not you're going through, you're not going drive through picking something up really quickly. So you have to take time to do that. And, um, you know, I take pride in how I, ex I handle it. Like, you know, all the questions a lot of clients ask during the process also. So they ask, I tell the clients, you, you have 101 questions to ask me that's the limit. So they go and they ask questions. Obviously, is it fake? It's not fake. Obviously, it's original. How do you get it? Uh, how how come you get it so fast? Um, you know, we have a very like an amazing team that's able to source us to watch this really quickly with our teams. So yeah, that's pretty much it. So you say, in summary, Mo, I need a Batman. I get the best price in the market. 
reaching out to as many dealers as we can. Once I get the best price, we add a small premium. You leave a deposit. I fund the watch. I then bring you the watch, explain you everything about the watch. And then off you go.